Yo, what's going on boys? Today I'm going to be playing some Expo Wizard, also known as Fireball on Top Ladder. So if you enjoy the video, please make sure to like and subscribe. And a huge shout out to Hunter for making this deck popular. Really fun deck, but not really that good on ladder. So I'll kind of try to make it work, but I'm not sure if I'll be able to win games with it. I'll try though, but anyway, it's going to log here. This guy might try to go for a freeze. I know that he plays like a P.E.K.K.A. freeze deck with um, Evil Archers and like XE NATO and stuff like that. So... Gonna be honestly pretty tough to get a lock. My wizard is not gonna do anything in this entire matchup, so I'm gonna have to watch out. Just gonna have to try to get back to my expo and keep going left and right, but I have to try to get to that sequence right now, though. Actually gonna expo with this wizard, and it should be some damage if I tornado the one archer into the P.E.K.K.A. I'm gonna wait till the last second of tornado, though, so I get, like, the maximum damage on the P.E.K.K.A. with the wizard. I'm gonna put it, like, right now. Oh, what? Oh, he has a tornado, too. Okay, that was kind of bad on my end. I could have done that a lot better, but I actually tornadoed like a little bit later than his tornado, so my wizard died. And he also has an Electro Spirit. Interesting, because he's playing a Graveyard Freeze deck, and it's pretty easy to activate King off like a Electro Spirit. So this guy must be really good with it. Like he must not like play Electro Spirit randomly on offense or something. But I'll see what I can do though. I'm gonna go for a wizard in the middle. Actually gonna put it all the way in the ah. Uh, I'll go knight in the middle. I don't want to put wizard all the way in the back, as then you could just go in and then try to go freeze on the wizard and the tower. So I'm gonna put it in the middle now. Okay, I'm gonna ice spirit now. I feel like he might freeze here though. Like he won't go in, but he might freeze to take out my wizard. Yeah, just go for the freeze. I'm gonna log right now, and that should take out the archers. No damage taken on my towers, but I'm still down a lot of damage right now. Down like 1900. So I'm gonna have to find a way to come back. I feel like if I just find a way to get that one good lock in this matchup and kind of hold my lead till like the end of the game, I might be able to win the game, but easier said than done though, I'm not sure if I'll be able to do all that. Okay, let's go for the P.E.K.K.A. So I'm gonna have to go for a cannon, I can't go for Wizard because he could try to tornado that in and that'd be pretty annoying for me. I'm not gonna Wizard, he definitely has a tornado in cycle right now, so I'm gonna Wizard in the back. Gonna let the P.E.K.K.A. die and then um, I think I'll try to go for like a Knight on the Axie. I'll just go Knight over here, and then I'll go for like a Tornado Ice Spear on the Dark Prince. Then I'll play my Log last second to clean up the Skellies, and should be pretty good defense. I think he's like one-off P.E.K.K.A. right now. Okay, back to P.E.K.K.A. But I'm gonna X on the left here. I'm gonna predict it on the right lane. Okay, that was a really good P.E.K.K.A. though. He put it like on top of the Wizard, tanking for the Expo as well. So I'm gonna Cannon hide to take out the Archers. They should dot him at Cannon, I'm pretty sure. Might have to Axie on the Expo, honestly. Yeah, wait, he's definitely gonna have to Axie on the Cannon. Or uh, on the Expo. I'm going to go for x on the right lane. He might not be able to peck on time for this, which is really good. I'm um, just going to knight right now. Electro Spear, definitely going to be able to peck on now, though. I could have tornadoed that back, but I know that he's got a freeze in cycle, so it would not make that big of a difference. I feel like he would have been able to reset the x and just uh, put me in the same position again. So knight on the left lane got some damage. I'll take that for sure. Also, this is a really good spot for me to keep going left and right because I just have to kind of capitalize on the fact that he doesn't have a good cycle right now not back to pekka so definitely gonna knight in the middle to block the xe okay got back to pekka now so he's probably gonna play it down low but my um evil knight on the opposite lane is gonna cause some trouble at least i probably should have tornadoed that in but i'm gonna let the evil knight die though he was able to archers on it and save it i'm gonna over defend this expo on the left lane and i'm kind of hoping to get like something out of it okay dark prince wait so he's gonna have to exit i'm gonna knight to block it nice well he doesn't have anything right now i'm gonna log he can only defensive freeze or try to go for like a P.E.K.K.A, but the P.E.K.K.A is going to come down late. Okay, he's probably going to freeze and then try to go for like Evo Archers. I'm going to cannon to predict. Okay, I'm going to Skellies on the side to not let those lock on. I'm going to NATO them away. Pretty annoying card, but honestly good defense played by me though. Okay, I got some damage here, but I might take more though. I'm going to Knight right now and then just going to try to go for a log on defense. Going to Ice Spirit as well. Okay, I just have to try to go for a Skellies right now. Alright, that was good. I'm going to Knight right now as well. He might try to freeze Tornado though. Yeah, definitely gonna freeze Tornado. I'm gonna Wizard again to take out the XE. Gonna Expo on the left here. Okay, I just have to watch out with the Tornado. I just have to like NATO stuff away. Gonna NATO right now. That should be on the tower. Yo! Wait, he's gonna have to freeze, but I don't even think. Okay, never mind. The E Spirit is gonna reset my Expo. I'll see if I can keep the second Wizard alive. I don't think I'll be able to, but I'll try. Wait, I was actually able to. No way. I'm gonna Expo. Just gonna try to go for. Wait, he let that lock on. I can just like tornado log cycle now. I'm gonna nato log. Gonna cannon, gonna skellies, ice spirit, just gonna nato on the tower, and I'll take the win. That was such a good game right there. I played such good defense, and like I was able to get a lock at the end on both the 
lane, so I was able to win the game by a little bit. But I'll take the win, though. That game felt so hard. I feel like that should have been my match, but still felt so hard. I'll take the win, though. Okay, I'm in my next match here. See what deck he's playing. I'm going to Skelly's in the back. I don't know what deck he could be playing, so I don't want a Wizard in the back first play. But Skelly's in the back. The, ah, perfect. Archers could just about be like 200 decks in the meta. I'm just going to do it anyways. Okay, Snowball and Archers actually could be drawing Graveyard, so going to have to watch out. Not that bad of a matchup because Tornado is going to help me out a lot. I can activate King off of like a lot of stuff right here, but... I just have to find a position to activate though. Like right now, I definitely cannot activate because of that giant. But if I kill that giant and keep the buller like healthy enough, then I might be able to activate off like a tornado and a knight. Wait. Yo, wait. I can actually activate king here if I play it smart. I'm going to knight like this and then going to tornado it in. Okay, one more shot and that should activate king tower. That's going to hit it. Nice. Oh my god, that was so good. Nice, I'll take the win. That's actually going to be an easy win because he can't go in for like the entire game now. He's playing Giant Graveyard, so King Activation is actually pretty bad for that deck because they can't often get any damage. So I should be able to kind of like just win this game patiently. But I'll try my best. I'll try to get damage like over time, even though he has a Bowler and a Giant. I'm going to make things pretty hard for me to get a lock, but all I need is one lock really. I just need that one good lock and then I can hold it for like the entire game and just win the game because... Once again, he can't afford to go in because I've got the king activated. So, gonna knight in the back to cycle. Okay, let's go for a litter prince in the back. I'm gonna wizard in the middle for it. I feel like that one should be able to take it out or bait out like an ability at least. Okay, let's go for the bowler. I'm gonna tornado actually. Tornado gets a lot of value here. So, just gonna nato and then take out the litter prince. I should be able to take out the guardian and the bowler as well. I'm gonna ice bear on the guardian. I don't know if that's gonna jump actually. My king tower is gonna help out a lot. Skelly's on the buller that might get one shot on my tower because I kind of misplaced it, but all good though He was able to defend that without taking a lot of damage. I'm gonna knight in the back Gonna wizard in the back as well. I have to go same lane with it because the other evil archer might take out my wizard if I don't so Just gonna have to try to go for a knight We're actually gonna cannon right now not a knight and then gonna expo here gonna ice bear on the left to take out the archer Okay, I'm stacking up like a lot of stuff on the left here because I should be able to get like a ton of damage here if I play this well. Okay, I'm gonna cannon again. He did go for the arrows, but yeah, the bowler should die to my cannon though. Okay, Expo's gonna get like one, two, three, four hits on the tower. Not too bad. I'll take that for sure. I mean, yeah, definitely worth it. I got some damage at least. Gonna wizard in the back to cycle. Man, I wish I got more though. Like it's so hard to get Expo log in this matchup, but I wish I got more. All good though. Just gonna try to go for an ice spirit. Then I'm gonna try to go for like a log tornado. Okay, this log tornado should take out like just about everything on the field. I'm gonna knight up high. Save the one HP expo because why not? And wait, the bowler is gonna die without taking out my wizard. But I can expo again. Wait, his cycle is slowly getting kind of bad. I can't lie. His cycle is actually getting cooked. Little by little, because he's having to play like a giant and a bowler on every single one of my expos. That's not good for his position right now, because he's going to want to save like a bowler or like a giant for like an entire expo. I'm cycling back through my expos like pretty quick, and he's not being able to keep up with it often. He's keeping up so far, but I know that like at some point in the future, he's going to fall off and just not be able to keep up with it. Like right now, it's going to be a lock right here. Yeah, and he can't play the giant down on time, so... That's going to be just about all the damage I needed to be able to win the game. Because I just have to kind of like defend the entire game now. That might sound tough, but with this deck, I feel like I might be able to defend out the entire game. I just have to watch out on the left lane when he splits Evil Archers in the back. Because I noticed that like I often like seem to ignore the opposite lane Archer when they do it. So just going to Axe on defense right now on the anti-arrow spot. I don't want him to do anything related to the right side tower. Just going to try to go for a Log Tornado. Okay, not too bad. Good value on the Log Tornado. Gonna go for a Wizard in the middle and then gonna try to go for like Skellies up high. Cannon on the Graveyard. Gonna Log as well. Giant should only get one hit on my tower, so it's not that bad. Evil Archer should die to my Knight now. Okay, my Wizard tank like two shots from that, but not too bad. Normal Archer should tank the one shot from the Wizard. Actually gonna die to it completely, which I don't complain about at all. I'm gonna try to go for a Cannon in the middle again. Okay, just have to defend for like, what, 25 more seconds, so... I think I'm okay. Gonna Ice Spirit the middle. Gonna Tornado that away so he doesn't take out my Wizard. I'm gonna Wizard again. Gonna Knight. Gonna try to go for a Log and then a Cannon. And I'll go for an Ice Spirit on the right lane. Okay, I think I'm good, right? 
I'm gonna tornado that away so it doesn't do any damage on my tower. Log, Evil Knight, and that should be good game, so I'll take the win. I'm gonna play one more game because games with this deck are pretty long, I'm not gonna lie. They've all been like five minutes long, so just gonna play one more and hope that it's not gonna be as long. No problem, even if it's long though, but let's see. Okay, on to my last game here. See what deck he's playing. I'm gonna try to go for a wizard in the middle to take out the wall breakers and. Okay, right off the bat, this matchup looks really bad because any kind of wall breaker deck has a minor poison in it and only some of them don't have anything. Like, for example, one of the decks doesn't really have like a big spell. Actually, it does have a fireball, but doesn't have like a minor. It just has like wall breaker spam. And honestly, it could be that deck because he's playing the recruits. So could have like Mother Witch and Fisherman and stuff like that. Maybe that I might be able to win, but I'm not sure that I'd have to like focus really hard but i know it's a really terrible matchup the whatever i'm facing right now is not a good matchup at all gonna wizard in the back right now test out what big spell he's got in the deck if not then i'll probably just go in on the right lane i'm just gonna axe on the right right now to see what deck he's gonna whip out i'm just hoping that he doesn't get back to the evil recruits on time but i feel like he's only one off though so i think i'm cooked yeah he's back to it now so i'm definitely not gonna be in a good spot right now but all good though, just gonna knight on the right lane, protect the expo, log on the evil recruits, and one of them's gonna charge into my tower and take it down to 2416. And I got no damage for that, by the way. Nice. Expo is so horrible, man. It definitely needs a buff. It just died to like an entire goblins. Like, I don't wanna compare it as like a two elixir and a six elixir card, but expo should not die to goblins. Like, never. It's a six elixir win condition. It should be like a little bit stronger, but. All good though, gonna go for a wizard in the back. The scowl says a flying machine, so I just have to watch out. Could have a poison or like a fireball. I haven't seen a big spell yet though, but could be one of those. I'm gonna expo right now on the left lane. Gonna try to go for an ice spirit. Okay, he's probably gonna try to go for like the litter prince. Yeah, let's go for it now. So I'm gonna log. Actually, not gonna log because he did that. He popped the ability pretty quick, so I'm not gonna log it. I'm gonna evil knight on it though. Actually, I don't need to. That's one shot. Yo, I'll take that damage right there gonna can in the middle i'm just gonna try to go for a wizard in the back again i feel like he can't punish me for this he didn't play a big spell yet so i don't even know what kind of spells he could be whipping out i mean i know that he has one big spell but i don't know what it is and yeah i just don't want the wizard to die before uh finishing its job so i'm gonna expo on the right lane here wait that was a really good expo the wizard is going to take out the flying machine so he's gonna have to like fisherman on me probably gonna have to eve arches on me too I'm gonna knight right now. Actually, yo, that was kind of bad. I'm gonna log right now to take out the Little Prince and then just gonna skellies here. Okay, the knight on the left lane is gonna do some damage on the tower and the expo on the right once again did not do much. I kind of caught up on the left lane though. I didn't even see what, what was going on, but I'll take that for sure. Gonna ice spear at the middle. Just gonna try to go for a knight in the middle. Okay, not too bad. Um, Eva recruits are gonna get one charge on the wizard, but I'm gonna nato this in though. Just gonna log right now. I didn't want to log because I thought he would log at the same time, maybe, so. Wanted to kind of stay careful. You don't want to get log predicted this late in the game, by the way. Like, if you do, then the game's just over, but. Gonna wizard in the back and then gonna can in the middle. I'm gonna go for an ice spirit in the middle to pull everything in the middle. Just gonna try to go for skellies on the side and then I'll go knight on the side as well. Okay, log on the left here to take out the wall breakers. I feel like this game's going right, but not really at the same time. Like, I don't know how to get damage here. I'm really not sure how to get damage in this matchup, but I'll try though. So far, not looking that great because he does have a big spell. So before he starts like spelling me out, I have to try to manage like a really good lead on my end. But anyways, gonna knight. Just gonna try to go for a wizard in the back. Okay, I'm convinced that this guy does not have a big spell. So just gonna play this thing in the back. Okay, one minute left. Um, definitely gonna be like the most stressful minute I've ever played, but all good though. Gonna log right now, gonna Ice Spirit. I'm just gonna try to go for an Expo into that thing. Gonna Skellies here, and then I'll just keep my Tornado ready. Okay, he played Recruits high, so I can't really Tornado that, but I'm gonna Knight to block the Recruits though. Gonna Ice Spirit, just gonna try to go for a Tornado. Okay, wait, that might lock on. Huh? Never mind. Actually, that's not gonna lock in. Who am I kidding? The ability took out the Expo, so it's definitely not gonna log in. I'm gonna go for a log right now. Okay, this game's all of a sudden not looking good. I could tornado, but I don't know if it's worth it though. Oh my god, okay. 
I don't like this at all. I'm gonna go for a wizard in the middle, gonna knight in the middle as well to pull everything in, gonna log and then gonna ice bear on this side. Okay, not too bad. Gonna skeletons over here and then I'm just gonna tornado. Yeah, I think I lost the game because I just can't get damage on the tower. I was kind of busy defending the whole game, so I was not able to get any damage, but kind of unfortunate that I have to end on a loss, but hope you guys enjoy the video. And if you do enjoy the video, please make sure to like and subscribe. Next video, I'm probably going to play more ladder and try to go for like 3,000 trophies with a different deck. So I love you guys and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.